24 rabbits brought to Australia just for hunting have opened such a business to the head of the government that, in 1859, an immigrant named Thomas Austin released 24 hares, which he brought from England to hunt in his spare time, to the Australian countryside. Within a few years, the rabbit population on the continent reached millions and when the calendars showed 1920, 70 years after the rabbits were released, the rabbit population on the continent exceeded 1 billion. They damaged more than 2 million acres in the Australian countryside, finally, in the 1950s, they brought the myxoma virus, which has an effect only on rabbits, from South Africa, and injected it into insects that were in the rabbit's food chain and released it to nature. This method was 90% effective, but the remaining 9% survived by developing immunity to this virus, and they expanded again until the 1990s, regaining 40% of the population they had lost. By developing a new virus in 1995, they managed to regain control of the rabbit population on the continent, but the fight against rabbits cannot be said to have been scrapped.